Hey Cancer, Everlong Mystic here. So we're gonna do a Lafruma shadow reading for you. I kinda wanted to show some of the versatility of this of this deck. And uh, one of my one of my tasks assigned by the deck to me on my first reading was to do shadow readings. So we're gonna we're gonna get started. Ooh, okay, so we have we have the pear tree, Perth, Cosmic Surge. Hmm. It's weird, this kind of feels, it feels very tempting. Like there's some kind of, I don't know, like an inclination or a temptation of some sort that troubles you. Bottom of the deck. We have oak. Support. That is so interesting that we get oak here and like in the background of this cosmic surge is this huge tree. Hmm. You know, this, this card here is asking you to expand here can on something, Cancer. But here, it's like there's, there's hesitation. Because of some kind of inclination. I don't know. It seems very vague, but that's, that's what I'm, that's what I'm feeling here. I want to see where this goes. Something is stale, something is, I don't know, old or stale, or, I don't know, I'm just getting, it's so weird. Man, the artwork is really talking to me on this one. But like here, like whatever this, this squiggly stuff here is around the poem. I mean, at, <clears throat> at first glance, it looks like little puzzle pieces, but then when, when I look at it more, it almost looks like, um, you know, like mushrooms growing out of a tree trunk, like something old, like old, like an old tree trunk that that's like breaking down, like a part of you breaking down to, but, but li there's still life there. You know what I mean? It's, it's very interesting. So cancer, you're, you're being complicated. It's like that whole thing of this and that are true. Oh, that's funny. This poem says, remember that before this, there was that. That's hilarious. All right, that almost flipped. It was mountain, but we're gonna, I wasn't ready. Now we will cut. Oh. So we have the chimera, 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 whatever, however you say it, but what, what this is, is something Something kind of unattainable. Something kind of unattainable. And I want to say that, Cancer, that maybe this unattainable thing is unattainable for a reason. Bottom of the deck. Conflict. You're not vibrational. You're not vibrationally compatible with it. That's why it's unattainable. It's like you're trying to grow something, 
that, man, that it sounds kind of, I don't know, please don't take this the wrong way, but it sounds like you're trying to grow something that wants a different life. Sounds like you're trying to grow something that wants a different life. It's, a, it's like a conflict of interest. It's a conflict of... It's like whatever whatever you're supporting here, like with this oak card, it's the card of support, right? Whatever you're trying to support... And I'm not saying everything you're trying to support. It's something, right? It's a thing. Whatever this is... There, there's a conflict. It's either like it's not vibrationally compatible with the surroundings or the environment. Because we have this tree, this big tree growing here in this cosmic surge. But then we have like an older, maybe dead tree where there's new life growing outside of it. Like it's, I mean, it's still growth. There's still life happening and things you know what i mean but it's not it's not what you are trying to do because of a conflict and the thing is though it's like this um with this spider now the spider can look a little creepy right like oh it's a creepy spider right but, but like this spider is smiling and this spider is not smiling because he's happy about conflict. The spider is smiling because something is growing the way it, the way it should. Like I don't know if this is just taking a more organic approach to something to kind of be in the flow with nature. You know what I mean? Instead of forcing cuz like the whole surge, cosmic surge like it's, it seems like, like pushing something that doesn't want to be pushed in the direction that you're pushing it, therefore unattainable, right? So, Cancer, we're going to pull just a couple tarot cards here. Is there anything else that Cancer needs to know about this? And I do, I, I do like that you have um, number 13 here, 13 frequency, right? That is, that's, that's what you, I mean, that's, that's what you want. That's like the, that's the most uh, benefic <laughs> thing, right? I mean, that's the Lafruma frequency, right? So we have the Empress. See, look. Cancer, this is, this is you. It's like you're sitting there, you're waiting, you're waiting for this thing to happen, and it's like you're going to be sitting there for a really long time, because whatever that is that you're pushing, it's not, it's not meant to be pushed that way. And then again, Knave of Swords, this is what, um, and I say again because Aquarius just, just got this. And it's like, are you, it's like, it's asking the question, are you brave enough? Are you brave enough to take a look at, to, to take a look at it, to take a look at how, how it really is? It's like, you're, you're, you're bound to learn something. Like, this is coming out because you are bound to learn something, either about you or your situation. And whatever it is. It may not be pretty, it may not be the, the truth that you want to hear, but it, it will allow, it's like it, it will allow something to spread, something to sprout, you know what I mean? It just may not be the thing that you wanted initially to sprout. Okay. So Cancer, this is, this is your Lift Room and Shadow reading, and I will see you later. Bye, Cancer.